New Year Mass begins at Our Lady Queen of Nigeria Pro Cathedral in Gerki, Abuja, the home of the Catholic Bishop of Abuja, Most Reverend Ignatius Kaigama. And though he's not here to celebrate with the Catholic faithful, his New Year message statement encapsulates the importance of 2023, Nigeria's election year, and the role citizens must play in changing the country's fortunes. His statement reads in part, as for the choice of political parties and candidates to vote for, we should be guided by the Council of St. Paul, which says, whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable, if anything is excellent or praiseworthy, think about such things. Philippians 4, 8. In choosing who to vote, let your head and your heart guide you, not your stomach and your pocket. At the Cathedral Church of the Advent in Life Camp Abuja, home to the primate of the Anglican Church of Nigeria, Most Reverend Henry Ndokoba, the New Year service kicks off with hymns in praise to God as the Anglican faithful count their blessings, grateful for the opportunity to witness the New Year. As the Anglican primate begins his New Year sermon, the import of Nigeria's election year also takes center stage, particularly the need for God's intervention in what he describes as a year of jubilee for Nigerians. 2023 shall be to us the acceptable year of the Lord. Amen. A year of jubilee, a year of unique divine intervention that will bring a turnaround in the lives of the people of this nation and those people also. Where is justice? Where is righteousness? Do we have conscience? Somebody has openly professed, declared, in fact, even given conditions for how you will deal with terrorism or terrorists. And everybody is sitting like this, as if nothing is being said. Brethren, it shall not continue. It shall not continue. We will continue to seek the face of God until the God who reigns in Zion will arise. Righteousness will exalt this nation. The call to vote wisely and demand accountability from government officials while holding on to faith. That is the message for the Christian faithful here as they dance into 2023, a year many say is one of the most important in Nigeria's history. Kayla Megwa, Channels Television News.